Back at work after a short vacation, President Bakane held a cabinet meeting this morning. She laid out her thoughts on a range of current issues, including the economy and, of course, the THAAD deployment decision. Song ji Sun has our top story. The president marked her return from her holiday by encouraging Koreans to vacation in the country just as she did last week. President Bak noted that the Korean economy is showing signs of recovery, growing 3.2 percent in the second quarter from last year, close to its potential growth rate. Putting emphasis on her drives to revive the economy and boost domestic demand, the president called on lawmakers to move forward with the government's fiscal stimulus proposal, saying a delay will not create jobs in a timely manner when there is a massive number of layoffs in the forecast following the government's corporate restructuring drive. 이번 추경 예산이 통과가 되면 6만 8천 개의 일자리를 창출할 수가 있는데 추경 처리가 늦어져서 효과가 바로 나타나지 않는다면 실직 위험에 직면한 근로자들의 불안이 커질 수밖에 없습니다. President Park also touched on the chosen location for the missile defense system, THAAD. She stressed that Seoul and Washington's decision to deploy THAAD in Songju, Gyeongsangbuk-do province, is aimed at protecting the public against North Korea's rising nuclear and missile threats and call for national unity on security issues. President Bak vowed to sit down with Songju governor and local lawmakers to hear their opinions on the matter, while also pledging to continue her field visits to assess how weather policies are working to boost local economies. Song Ji-sun, Arirang News.